what I'm going to do is I'm going to transfer load from one bag to another. So actually it's, it's a lot, <clears throat> a lot simpler or as easy as scooping it straight out of the sand using uh, your hands or a shovel. Um, this is, this is a, this is an easy way to do it if you've already got one bag, you know, transfer it to another bag, maybe the, from the 25 pound of the 40, essentially <clears throat> you just stick the opening inside and there you go. On this one, I'm going to try to get all the sand in. These are actually two 40 uh, pound capacity bags. And I say 40 pound, not because that's as much weight as it can handle. That's just, <clears throat> if you're using dry sand, that's typically how much weight you'll get. If you add water to it, it'll get heavier. If you put pebbles in there, it'll be heavier. The bags can carry more weight <clears throat> than just 40 pounds. But again, if you're using dry sand, that's essentially what you'll get at right around 40. Now... The top is expandable. Some guys, you know, <clears throat> push the limits on the edge. But again, if you're filling it up to the seam of the bag, right here, there's a seam inside there, right at the the edge here. So if, if you're filling it up to the seam, the top seam, you'll get 40 pounds approximately. So still got a little bit of sand left in here. I'm just gonna. Do a full transfer. A little spillage. And just pack it down like that. go and then we're going to seal it up to seal it up we're going to put <clears throat> the stitched edge over the plastic reinforced edge so we have one edge here plastic reinforced and then one edge here that has a stitching on it or stitched essentially the stitched edge will go over the plastic reinforced edge and just do three rolls clasps tuck that underneath the handle and you're good to go